Hey, welcome to my channel, Cook It With Manual Focus, and today we're gonna be making something absolutely delicious. I know you've seen that thumbnail. Yes, sir, we making Sloppy Joes. Now, one of my childhood favorites, now what you can do is look at the description box, get the detailed ingredients, follow along with this recipe, because I got you in the game. Without further ado, hey, let's go down to this workstation and let's focus on these Sloppy Joes. We're gonna go ahead and get this recipe started. We got a ground. 80 20 ground beef now what i want to do is i want to add a tablespoon of water and then about a fourth of a teaspoon of baking soda now this baking soda mixture right here is going to keep your ground beef moist when you brown it right so what that baking soda does is it raises the ph on the um, ground beef and this is going to help keep this meat moist and tender so we're gonna let this sit for about five minutes let that you know that baking soda and that water do its work and then we're gonna turn our stove on medium high heat and we're gonna brown this ground beef right, and we're going in with that ground beef again this is 80 20 and we're gonna be working over medium high heat and we'll just get this meat brown and while we're working on browning this meat I'm gonna go ahead and add my bell pepper so I got uh, bell pepper dice and then I'm gonna add half of a yellow onion and this is going to cook and render down as we brown this ground beef and fam i'm gonna tell you sloppy joe's growing up was like one of my favorite go-to recipes and i'm gonna tell you if you love sloppy joe's you're gonna love this recipe here all right fam we got this ground beef where we want it it's nice and browned now what we want to do is we want to drain this excess oil off of this ground beef and then we're gonna come back we're gonna season this up we're gonna get this sauce ready to go so we got this ground beef drained and what i want to do is i want to make sure you know we got this ground beef to the consistency that we want it to be so i want to get it you know a little bit finer i got a little thicker thick chunks right now and you can go with whatever you like man if you want thicker chunks of ground beef you can definitely have that but i want to get this you know a little bit more on the finer side So as we get this ground beef, the consistency that we like, I'm gonna switch my utensils. And now what I wanna do is I wanna add me about a tablespoon of minced garlic. And this is about four garlic bulbs or whatnot, minced. And then I'm gonna let this cook till it becomes fragrant. And as you can see here, those bell pepper and those onions have rendered down nicely now when that garlic becomes fragrant we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna add about about a cup and a half of ketchup then I'm gonna go in with a couple of tablespoons of tomato paste I'm gonna hit it with some chili powder going in with some ground mustard a couple of dashes of W sauce come in with about a tablespoon of red wine vinegar Hit it with some Italian seasoning. Then I'm going in with some crushed black pepper. And you can go heavy handed with the pepper if you like. And that'll be good for now. So what I wanna do is I wanna get everything mixed in for now. So we're gonna add in some beef broth after we get everything mixed in. And fam, this is smelling absolutely amazing. Now, what I want to do is I want to add about a tablespoon of light brown sugar. And we'll get everything, again, mixed in. Let those flavors marry and marinate with that ground beef. And like I said, fam, this is smelling absolutely delicious. And as you can see here, vibrant colors. Hey we in the game fam last ingredient that we're going to add so we're going to add some beef broth about a cup and a half worth of beef broth and then we're going to let this simmer this is going to be an absolutely delicious sloppy joe recipe that the whole fam is going to enjoy and fam i wish you two would invent something where you know you can smell what i'm cooking Get those nice aromatics because I'm telling you, man, this smells absolutely delicious and it's looking fantastic, fam. So, we're gonna let this simmer um, for about 15 minutes or so and let these ingredients do its thing. But, fam, this right here 
hey, it looks good, and you're going to be in the game, fam. So we're going to put that top on this Dutch oven, and we're going to let this bad boy simmer. All right, while we let that sauce simmer, what we're going to do is we're going to toast that some buns. So I'm going in with some butter. And we're going in with some brioche buns. And once we get these buns toasted to our liking, hey, like this right here, hey, we're in the game. Now all we gotta do is wait for that sauce to finish simmering, and then we're gonna assemble these awesome, delicious Sloppy Joes. And while they're still warm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add me some cheese to one, some American cheese like that. All right, fam, we let that sauce simmer. And look at that right there. Yes, sir. So let's go ahead and finish assembling this sloppy joke. All right, fam, all this is is just assembling these sloppy joes. Look at that sauce right there. Yes, sir. Fam, all we gotta do is put that top hat on it that and you know what hey we can pile this one a little bit higher there you have it fam absolutely delicious sloppy joe gotta do we gotta give the sloppy joe a taste test hey cheers and this thing is sloppy too. Mmm. Fam, that's absolutely delicious. Now, hey fam, when that sauce starts running off that bun, hey, go ahead, grab your spoon, grab your fork, and go ahead and take another bite of that absolutely delicious sloppy joke. Cheers, fam. Man. That is absolutely amazing, fam. Now, fam, if you're new to this channel you like this content, go ahead, smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on that bell so you can get the notifications as well when I release my content. Now, for the focus, fam, that's been rolling me for a while, you already know I got you in the game, and I'm about to smash into these sloppy joes. And until next time, I'm about to roll out. Peace.